joyful noisemakers. Hi friends, it's me, Miss Mary. I'm so excited to spend some time with you. I hope that you are having a wonderful, lovely day. We're gonna sing some songs, share some artwork, read some books. Most of all, I hope that we have some fun together. Shall we begin? The Lord be with you and also with you. Alleluia, alleluia. We're gonna start right off the bat with a song you know, okay? If I go like this, get ready to do this. Deep and wide, deep and wide, I've got a river flowing deep and wide. Deep and wide, deep and wide, I've got a river flowing deep and wide. Okay, we're going to do that really, really fast. Miss Mary is going to get out of breath. Let's do this, friends. Deep and wide, deep and wide, I've got a river flowing deep and wide. Deep and wide, deep and wide, I've got a river flowing deep and wide. I did get out of breath, just like I thought I would. Now that Miss Mary has caught her breath, friends, I have another song to sing. We've done this a few times, and I like this because it reminds me that I am so thankful for so many things that God has given me. And this is about my eyes and my nose. I can smell, I can taste, I can hear, I can touch. I hope that you remember this song. Thank you, God, that I can see the stars up in the sky. Thank you, God, that I can see. Thank you for my eyes. Thank you, God, that I can smell the perfume of a rose. Thank you, God, that I can smell. Thank you for my nose. Thank you, God, that I can taste a ripe and juicy plum. Thank you, God, that I can taste. Thank you for my tongue. And this is where, friends, we all stick our tongue out. Ah. Thank you, God, that I can hear a loud and happy cheer. Thank you, God, that I can hear. Thank you for my ears. And I also love to wear earrings, so thanks for that, too. Thank you, God, that I can touch the gritty, grainy sand. Thank you, God, that I can touch. Thank you for my hands. Thank you for our hands, God. They come in handy. I can do this. Notes from Jesus. So, my friend, this note from Jesus is about how we can laugh together. And the first thing that caught my eye was this emoji, this smiley face. Doesn't he look like he's laughing so hard? And look, his tongue is even in the shape of a heart. I don't know if that's on purpose, but I'm going to say it. It says, may God fill you completely with joy and peace. Joy and peace. So let's read what it has to say. I want you to know we can laugh together. Everybody, let's laugh. <laughs> that's good. Doesn't that feel good? When did I get a reputation as a sourpuss? Do you know what a sourpuss is, my friends? A sourpuss is somebody who goes like this to like, or, or. Isn't this much better? You hardly ever see a painting of me laughing or a stained glass window that shows me giggling or a joke. That's what Jesus says. I'm always shown serious and frowning like I just sucked on a lemon. That's what Jesus says. He says, but that's not me. Around me, there's light and laughter and joy. The joy of being forgiven, the joy of feeling understood, the joy of fresh hope. In my kingdom, joy is an everyday event. Sort of like the weather. So, it's okay if you and I aren't always frowning in concentration. Let's laugh instead. Let's be thankful. Let's dance and sing. When something wacky happens to you, I want to hear about it. Tell me about what surprises you, delights you, and tickles your funny bone. Let's laugh together. And look, he's got this really great heart. So I thought maybe a little Father Abraham so that we can move our bodies in wacky, fun ways. 
Okay, friends, let's get our wackiness on. We're going to sing some Father Abraham. Are you ready? Are you loosening up? Are you getting your arms ready and your legs ready? Okay, let's do this. Father Abraham had many sons, had many sons, had Father Abraham. I am one of them, and so are you. So let's just praise the Lord right arm. Got your right arm swinging. Father Abraham had many sons, had many sons, had Father Abraham. I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord right arm, left arm. Father Abraham had many sons, had many sons, had Father Abraham. I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord right arm, left arm, right foot. Father Abraham had many sons, had many sons, had Father Abraham. I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord. Right arm, left arm, right foot, left foot. Father Abraham had many sons, had many sons, had Father Abraham. I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord. Right arm, left arm. Right foot, left foot, chin up, sit down. <laughs> okay, that was fun. Hi, friends. Watch this. It's the bubbles. Merrily, merrily, merrily fly. See the bubbles floating by. Bubbles fly high, bubbles fly high. Bubbles fly low, bubbles fly low. See the bubbles merrily go. Got my nose. Merrily, merrily, merrily fly. See the bubbles floating by. Bubbles fly high, bubbles fly high, bubbles fly low, bubbles fly low. See the bubbles merrily go. So that got me thinking about a song about cleaning things. This book, my friends, is called Being Nice is Lots of Fun. I got this from my friend Rebecca. Hi, Rebecca. So it has it's a very old book, and it has some really funny pictures. Look, he is scrubbing a tub, and he looks like he's pretty dirty right there. Maybe he was dirty in the tub, is right? right? And then, look, is this cat looking fine? His dirty hands on the towel, and it says, scrub the tub. Scrub the tub, scrub the tub. Take the cloth and rub, rub, rub. Make it shine, make it shine. Now you're doing fine, fine, fine. Get that ring, get that ring. Wipe it off with a zinc, zinc, zinc. That's just right. That's just right. Leave a tub that's white, white, white. I hope you're finding ways to get your knees and hands a little dirty. Thank you, Rebecca. If I were the rain, what would I say? If I were the rain, what would I say? I'd say that. That's what I'd say. <laughs> That's what I'd say. If I were a dog, what would I say? If I were a dog, what would I say? If I were a dog, what would I say? There's the stick. Fetch it. That's what I'd say. I wonder if any of my friends out there have something else we'd like to say if I were wrong. Let me see. Raise your hands. Raise your hands. Let me see. I can pick on Everly. Everly. What would you like? A mosquito? Let's see about a mosquito, everybody. Let's see. I think it says, I want to suck your blood. If I were a mosquito, what would I say? If I were a mosquito, what would I say? If I were a mosquito, what would I say? I want to suck your blood. And then we would take the spray. The spray. That's what I'd say. You know, my friends, how much I love getting artwork from you. It means so much to me. And it's such a wonderful way to draw what we're feeling or what we're thinking or maybe what we see and we interpret with our fingers, with colors. 
I was sent this picture. Now, you can see that there's blues and greens. It's long. I actually, friends, I don't know if it's supposed to be this way or this way. Isn't that a wonderful thing not to know sometimes? We can wonder about it. I also, I don't know if you can see, this side is lighter than that side. See how my friend has put in some white spots? Or maybe she, it's not white spots she put in, but maybe that's the color that didn't always go in. And I wonder what that meant to her. And if we put it this way, maybe, maybe it looks like the sun is here and this is in maybe shadow. I wonder. That's one of the things I love about paintings, is that we can wonder about them. And there's no right or wrong answer, is there? You know, you can always send me artwork and I am so excited and grateful to share it with you, friends. It occurred to me that I was outside singing songs to you and reading books, and we saw a dog today. So it reminded me of this song. I saw a dog in the yard today, and what do you think I heard that dog say? It said, roof, roof, it said, roof, roof, it said, roof, roof. said meow meow I saw a horse on the farm today and what do you think I heard that horse say it said nay it said nay it said nay I saw a cow in the pasture today and what do you think I heard that cow say it said moo it said moo it said such fun today. We had some wacky times. We laughed, we read some stories, and we saw some pictures. And you saw my dog. His name is Toby. So before I leave and wish you another wonderful week, I have always three things to tell you. One, hug your people. Hug them tight. Two, Try to find something to smile about or laugh about, or better yet, help somebody else find something to laugh and smile about. And finally, know that you, my friends, are loved. Our time has ended. Now go in peace. Alleluia, alleluia. Bye, friends. I'll see you next time. Joyful noisemakers. Joyful. Joyful noisemakers. Joyful noisemakers.